Hello! And welcome back to, uh, Sonic Adventure. Uh, you know, today I'm going to be continuing my playthrough's tale. Uh... So I believe we're going to Casinopolis now. <clears throat> Wait, Casinopolis is the other way, I believe. Yes. That damn fly's still in my room, in case you're wondering. In between videos, I attempted to find it, but could not. So anyways, uh, now I'm just kind of, uh, stuck with it until, you know, we can kill it. But Casinopolis is a quick, quick one-and-done level. I'm surprised it's even a level. Come on, Tails! Ah, damn it, Sonic, you cheating bitch. You got Spin Dash, I just got Flight. Come back here, fuck. Come back here, you blue fuck. You blue, blue mother... Hey, hey, Sonic! I, I don't know where I was going with that. I was gonna be like, hey, so oh, fuck. I mean, good thing Sonic like, waits for you, but he doesn't have to charge up a. S oh! I'm, te I'm technically ahead of him. Shit! Ooh, I'm going up higher. Ooh, I'm ahead of him. <laughs> yes. Score one for Leroy. <laughs> uh, I don't know why that popped into my head. Just the entirety of Sonic Boom is it's underrated. It, like, even the games, the comics, and especially the show, it's just all over. It's all underrated and overhated. In reality, if everyone just like everyone knows the show was good, but they, but everyone wants to ignore uh, the fact that there were more games than Rise of Weird. There was Sonic Dash 2, which I uh, say I don't like. Hmm. And of course, then there was um, there was Shattered Crystal and Fire and Ice, which were both really good games. But yet, everyone overshadows them. Overshadows them. And when they say Sonic Boom, they always mean Rise of Lyric. Even even then, Rise of Lyric was not that bad. And yes, I will be playing it on the channel. So fuck you guys if you don't want to see that. Because oh, I will. Sonic. What happened to the Chaos Emerald? Uh, Eggman got one of them, but the other one's safe. He must be getting desperate. Now the emerald count is two to one, and Eggman's winning. Let's get a move on. Hawk, hawk, hawk. I'm sorry, I. Cream. Ah, oh, but there's cream, guys. Oh wait, I need to find the blue stone. But anyways, yeah, that's that like the best Easter egg ever. The fact that cream is just. Flying through Station squ Square is the best Easter egg ever. I fell in love cream. Such a sweetie. But, um... Speaking of cream, at some point I am going to be doing he Heroes, Battle, and Sonic Advance 2. As far as Sonic Advance 3, uh... Wait, I was doing Sonic Advance 1 and two at some point, and then I just dropped them. Anyways, ignoring the fact that that happened, and I ne never went back to the game ever, um, I don't know. There's a lot of games that I, like, skipped, that I started, never finished, but I have plans to go back and redo or continue. I'm all, I'm, all those games that are started and never finished, you know, like, Advance, uh, a Rut, Sonic 3, Sonic Rush, um, 
all of the advanced games. I started those at some point, and then I didn't want to. So at some point, I am going to go back and replay them. I mean, I'm not gonna, like, get all the Chaos Emeralds in them. Because fuck that shit. Come on, but, um, I will, like, go back and play through Advance 1 and 2 at some point. Now, when that some point will be, I never know. I'm thinking I'm going to... I, I could play through Sonic Advance right now on my DS. But that might, that might be something I do. Soon, because um, the advanced games are good. Yeah, that could be the next playthrough I do. Even though I kind of have plans to do Forces and Sonic Origins next. Sonic Origins is just the excuse to redo my Sonic 3 playthrough because I feel bad I never finished it, and at the same time I kind of don't want to finish it on mobile just because the emulator, you know really wasn't that good and, you know, playing it on an emulator is not doing the game justice, especially on a mobile emulator. And yeah, I get, you know, I'm not really giving you guys the best quality ever, but that is one reason I kind of have stopped. Games like Kirby 64 and, um, you know, Sonic Adventure 3 because, I mean, not Adventure, Sonic 3, again, mostly because... Again, I was playing those on emulators, and, well, yeah, they look better recording-wise, they just, you know, besides, I don't really get to play them, because I'm constantly safe-stating, but, as far as the games I did finish, like, Pocket Adventure, I'm, if I ever do revisit some of games like that, it will be, uh, in, like, a live stream or something. But aside from that, um, I don't really have, again, games I want to revisit and or finish at some point is, again, Sonic 3 through Sonic, or well, Sonic 1, 2, CD, and 3, all through Sonic Origins, I'm going to, at, at some point, I'm going to start a new Minecraft series, but as of now, I'm going to... I, I'm, I'm gonna kind of sort of finish up mobile games I've intended to finish or, or like my friend Pedro I'm gonna be playing through that entire game I already know I want to I know I said that about Nameless Cat and have kind of dropped the whole series now but my friend Pedro I don't know I'm, I'm gonna be doing that I, at some point, I might get tired of it and decide to drop the series and not and leave it unfinished. Same with Catbird. Although I don't really think anyone would care if I don't play that game. What's the matter, Knuckles? You're afraid of a toddler? Oh, you just gotta spam the B button and fuck him up. I just Sonic was nowhere, was nowhere doing that in a reaction, and he was like, oh, hey, wait a minute, yeah, I'm in this. Like, he already got his paycheck from Sega for his story, he don't give a fuck anymore. See, that's a way better line than me, what about you? Or whatever Knuckles said in the Sonic video. 
Where's that damn fourth chaos? <laughs> Bro, I can't wait till I play Shadow. Like, I'm gonna hate myself because I have to go through like 20 different stories or the same level like 20 different times each playthrough, but then again, I could always look up a guide. have much to say right now. I'm just gonna fuck up chaos and then giga chat my way into the next video whenever I do record that. I don't know when I will though. Whoa! Hey there, chaos! Chaos, why are you a giant fucking fish? I thought you were like the god of the street. Come on, tail. Well, it might be easier if I did just get up close to him and then... That's the only problem with, um, you know, that's the only downside whenever you, um, play like a 3D Sonic game with multiple characters. Since you can't just give everyone the homing attack, I mean, like, you give everyone the spin mesh, you know, it would be nice if you give everyone their own v version of the homing attack, like, tails, like, if you, like, Spin in the air and like, like, um, you know, like if you're like running and then you like spin, or like you curl into a ball. Y you know what I mean. Whenever you like randomly go into a ball instead of just like spinning with your tails, it'd be nice if that like honed in onto an enemy. I, I tried punching you, Chaos. Shit. Well, actually, you tried punching me, I tried spinning into you, but it failed miserably. Are you surfacing already, you dumb fish? There we go. But, um, yeah, just like, I mean, like, Knuckles, like, you could have, like, hit, um... Like his dive punch thing from a glide be homing, you know, you could have Amy like throw her hammer and it comes back to her. Or just like any variation of that. That would work so fucking well to improve a 3D Sonic game when you have to play as other characters or like, you know. Like since Amy is, you know, a speed character, just like give straight up give her the homing attacker. You know. I mean, like, I'm, I'm gonna go into this. Well, actually, I think I'll wait till the Amy, till I start playing Amy's story. Uh, I love that line delivery. That egg carry I know I ragged a lot on the voice acting throughout the Sonic playthrough, but sometimes it is really good. Or at least, like, the line delivery is kind of funny. Yeah! Is that one gonna mention the fact that Sonic just has a bracelet he never had before? Well, anyways, if they're not gonna mention it, I guess I will. I'm surprised Tails don't. <coughs> I'm not gonna go and take the tornado yet. I'm not doing that in this episode. Because I don't want to. And besides, it's time for me to. Go ahead and start my next video. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, um, uh, yeah, do the YouTube thing. Subscribe, uh, fucking donate if you can. I, I don't give a shit if you have the money or not. Just do it anyways. Uh, like, uh, comment down below. Pineapple Wonder Pants, and I, uh, I may, I, wait, let me, let me just. 
If you come at Pineapple Wonder Pants, I won't steal your kneecaps. <laughs> <laughs>